Hello. For those of you who don't know me, I am Mrs. Boston and I'm Head of Drama. I also run the Performing Arts course at Kingsley School. In this presentation, I'm going to outline some of the benefits and advantages and interest points of taking the Performing Arts or Theatre Studies A-Level. I would now like to share the screen with you to show you a PowerPoint presentation. We take performing arts and A level drama and theatre. These are the courses that we offer, and within each course, there's flexibility in choice and what you can specialize in. At present, we do not offer production arts as a standalone qualification, but you are able to import units from the production arts into the performing arts. For example, you could import a unit on lighting design into your performing arts qualification. There are other production arts units such as stage management, sound design, costume design that you could also choose to do. So now we are going to look at the Pearson BTEC subsidiary diploma in performing arts. Why it is a good subject to take. It is a flexible qualification and provides a stepping stone to a wide range of higher education courses, not limited to art and design related subjects. You can study performing arts as part of a program of study that includes other BTEC level three qualifications and A-levels. So this means you can use your qualification to get a place at a university in a wide range of academic studies as well as in performing arts subjects. The design of the course provides you with the skills, knowledge and understanding to progress to further higher education training and employment in the performing arts industry. Employers like it, and by the end of the course, you will have a substantial portfolio of different projects that you can use when applying for a job. What sort of pupils does it sort? Well, it's ideal for students who have an interest in the performing arts and are considering a career in the sector However, the qualification is equivalent to any A-level qualification and thus can be used to progress to study subjects of a more academic nature and that are recognized at recognized universities in the UK and abroad. It's ideal for students who have a flair for language, creativity, whether it be in art, music, drama, creating, creative writing, who really, really enjoy expressing themselves, communicating with others. And it is well suited to students who enjoy working in a group and collectively solving problems, as well as at times taking on a leadership role. What do you study? You will study mandatory learning and teaching modules, including skills development, the global performing arts industry, personal performing arts profile, and collaborative performing arts projects. Assessment units. The assessment units are as follows. Firstly, exploring performance styles. You will review the stylistic conventions of performance material, apply performance skills 
and techniques to performance materials in response to a brief and apply stylistic conventions to performance material in response to a brief. A2, creating performance material. In this, you would demonstrate an understanding of performance skills and techniques when creating and developing performance mastery material in a response to a brief. Apply creative processes when developing performance material in response to a brief. And finally, apply technical skills when creating a performance, performance material. And the assessment three, performing for an audience. So you develop and realize a performance through rehearsal and review creative decisions made in rehearsal. Finally, this qualification is awarded at pass, merit, distinction, and distinction star level. Now we are going to move on to the Theatre Studies course. Pearson A-level drama and theatre. Why is it a good subject to take? Well, A-level drama and theatre is a highly respected traditional A-level recognised by all the top universities, including Oxford and Cambridge. It is held in high esteem as an academic qualification. It has a wealth of transferable skills such as teamwork, leadership skills, listening, public speaking, problem solving, and so on. These skills are held in high regard by employers. And finally, it provides a gateway into drama schools. Past recent students have been offered places at RADA, Royal School of Speech and Drama, London, and Italia Concord. What sort of pupils does it suit? It is ideal for students who have an interest in the performing arts and are considering a career in the sex sector. It is an excellent combination with other A-level subjects such as English, history, psychology, art. It also complements subjects such as maths and physics and helps to develop a creative and expressive skills. It is well suited to students who enjoy working in a group and collectively solving problems as well as times taking on a leadership role. What you study? Well, there are three components. In the first component, you devise an original practical performance, and this is a practical assessment, and you are asked to use your creative creativity and explorative skills and to apply the theory of one practitioner. Component two is text in performance. This is a practical performance in which you work on two extracts of different scripts from existing plays and you present a group performance and a monologue or duologue performance. And you can choose to do a design skill such as lighting, sound, costume with makeup and hair, set, etc. for these two components. So that doesn't that means you do not have to act. You could be a design student. And number three, component three, is theatre makers in practice. Now this is a written exam and it involves live theatre evaluation, realising performance text and interpreting a performance text. If you have any questions about this qualification, which is indeed again highly flexible and can be tailored towards the interests of the students, please do speak to me at another time. Finally, this 
like all A levels, is graded according to A star, A, B, C, D, and E. Thank you for joining me. I hope you have found this recording useful.